we are, we are back again for another week of The Quarry. <sighs> what should be our final? I feel like that's optimistic. Try determine. Some of us haven't slept much. <laughs> <laughs> Well, um, we have a body count of zero so far in this game. Which is surprising. Very surprising. I uh, can't wait to see who you kill. I mean, I have the utmost faith in your abilities I to I can't QTE. wait to see what idiotic fuck up you make. Honestly, yeah. I might be the one to fuck, fuck this <laughs> one up. Because you always make one idiotic fuck <laughs> up. Have I made any yet? I don't think so, which means it's coming. This, which means it's bound to happen. Well... Move on to our favourite part of opening the stream. Dying to opening this. I'm really thirsty. But I feel like this is the wrong drink for being really thirsty. Is that water, juice or wine? <laughs> there's, there's a cider on the bed. That is, that is mine. He just looks after himself, you know. I have to provide my own refreshments and everything these days. Um, we have a new flavour, Monarch. Like a butterfly. Is there a butterfly called a monarch? But, but, blah, 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 blah. Yes, and they're all over the can. I know. I noticed that. I just didn't tie the two together. Um, this <laughs> one has apple, peach, pear, pineapple, nectarine, mango, banana, banana, banana. Um, so we're gonna open. So I can't wait. Three, two, one. What can't do it? <laughs> Shagged it. <laughs> Oh. Try it, it pops off. I've been thinking about that all day. What? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no? It's very peachy. Yeah. You don't like peach? <laughs> I like real peaches, not like fake peach flavor, but I really like peaches. But I do also like tinned peaches. Tinned. Oh yeah, that used to that used to oh, be like tinned. Tinned peaches used to be like a solid dessert when I was growing up. So when you said tinned, my my mind was like T I N D, and I'm like, what the fuck? No, is that? like no. Tinned, tinned peaches in syrup. Yeah, yeah. Today at work, mm -hmm. it's finally happened. I've Someone met... stolen your lunch at work? No, I have met another human being other than my dad that loves. Salmon spread and cheese and onion crisp butties. Say that again. Salmon. Salmon spread. You've seen me eat this. Yeah, no. Salmon spread and cheese and onion crisp butties. And when I made it, Jerry's face was much like this one now. But it is the stuff of... This is because I don't remember. You were like, what the fuck are you doing? Yeah, and I probably cast that out of my memory for good reason. It's delicious. And someone I was working with today was like... Oh my god! I've never met someone else that likes it. This small pit of hell that you, those lot reside in. <laughs> and then we were both like, "It's our go-to." I don't feel well meal because we used to eat it when we were kids. Uh huh. <laughs> I've got to put myself back in frame real quick. Sorry. Um. So you said other than your dad, but you eat it as well. Yeah, my dad was the one that used to make it. For that me put, as that a kid. put you on. Okay, fair. Has to be white bread. <laughs> Has to be white bread. Sorry, I was going to do the sandwich. obligatory. What's wrong with brown bread? But yeah, I love brown bread, but not for this sandwich. No, brown bread is a different kind of sandwich. Okay. You need white bread, a bit of butter, a liberal portion of salmon spread, and then crush up all your walkers on them and squish it all down. It's amazing. Crisps or chips, wherever you're from, based on wherever you're from, in a in a sandwich or butty or bun. I love it. Nah, I'm I I'm very northern. I, I love a crisp sandwich. I, I love a roast potato sandwich. I can't abide by it. You said you could get on top on board with a roast potato sandwich with like proper butter on. Because you were like, yeah. that's like a chip butty. Yeah. But even chip butties, I wouldn't. Okay, I don't condemn chip but chip butties. You're too southern. But I wouldn't. I wouldn't have one. <sighs> like not by not by my own volition. With a bit of gravy on. With a bit of gravy. Bit of gravy on it. Well, you Yorkshire folk. I'm not from Yorkshire. <laughs> well, you northern folk. <laughs> How 
dare you? Is it Lancashire or Mancunia? Mancunia? Do you mean Greater Manchester? I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> Mancunia. I come from the kingdom of Mancunia. Mancunian. Mancunian. Yeah, Mancunian. That's what I said. I, I just didn't. Mancunia. I didn't, yeah. So. Quarry. Sorry. Oh, no, apologize. Um, is there sound coming from the... Oh, I muted the game. Tee hee hee. Right, here we go. Do you remember what happened last time? Ezra Miller jumped out the window. Yeah. He may or may not be Yossi. alive. Nick, by the way. Yeah. Um, no bed stuck in a bear trap. Who? The one no I bed. Like. I'm Jacob. Yeah. yeah. You don't remember the names, do you? I've struggled with the names <laughs> when it's not like coming up in a subtitle. Mm-hmm. The one. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hot girl is kind of killing it. Um, She's doing well. Emma's doing well. Okay, Emma, right? Yeah, because I'm like, uh, like the one that thinks she's hot. Yeah. Um, (laughs) We're finding out what happened to those other two that arrived the night before, and honestly, that story is not giving yet. Too bad because we're going to go back. I know we are. Yeah. Um, I feel like the character that is me is currently in some kind of oh my god I shot him mm-hmm. breakdown um someone lost an arm who oh yeah uh, Dylan Cole Sprouse lost an arm yeah. London Tipton's just vibing yeah she's not really doing that much no, no she just not. has a quip to add <laughs> <Just a> quip. <laughs> she carries on looking hot Making funnies. Like in heart making funnies. Have we messed anyone out of that? No, you've got every- you got everyone. No, uh, Ryan. And everyone's Ryan. a everyone's a hack it. Oh, Ryan's just chilling, isn't he? And everyone's a hack it. Everyone's a hack it. Everyone in the woods is a hack it. The sheriff is a hack it. Those two blokes, the big one and the old one, they're hack it's. The Chris Hackett as well, the the, well, he's yeah. fucked off, hasn't he? Yeah. Oh, someone was dead in a swimming pool. Who had turned out to be Kaylee. Another Hackett. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hackett's Hack, hack everywhere. It's there. Hackett's there. Yeah, Hackett's hack everywhere. Quarry. The game takes place at... Um, sorry, the game is meant to be about 10 hours long. Looking at that time there, six. it's basically six hours. That depends on how many characters that we, we kill by the end of it. 10 hours is... 10 hours is the ideal like everyone is alive mm. the next few weeks were long so this is continuing right from where we left off and let us take showers but aside from that we barely saw him at least he's letting them be clean max and i we talked a lot as much as we could about what happened that night it was like trading conspiracy theories we talked about the cop the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a a plan. Well, you keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so. Weeks? You know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT. Tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth. Okay, okay. Stop. <laughs> One problem at a Vivid. Time. All 
okay? We don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. I told you that's what, so what happened. So let us go. Or what? werewolf. But he turned into the thing. Yeah. Try to and he'll turn back. And make yeah. Our escape. Oh. Um. First of all, hi Emily. Hi. <laughs> um. Second of all. What if we got on his? Hey, yo, fuck the police. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, fuck the 12. I'm not going to be missing this fucker one second longer than I have to. We've got to escape. Cool. Okay. So how? Max is kind of drippy, isn't I don't know. he? Knock exactly. him out? Knock like, him. Uh... Laura, you know that's kind of a movie thing only, right? <laughs> I mean, you bang someone on the head, you're more likely to kill them or leave them with permanent brain damage, not just knock them out. Well, what can you do? Yeah. I just realized who this actress is. Um, I forgot her name, but she's in the live action adaptation of Deadly Class, which is a really good adaptation of a comic book that I used to read. Um, which unfortunately ended at a really pivotal point, like big cliffhanger and everything, but didn't get renewed for a second season, which was mm. unfortunate. Um, okay, fine. So we don't. And she was one of the main out. characters. I guess in it. that means send friend request. Uh. No. I wasn't saying that we shouldn't break his head open. Just that we might be doing a whole lot more than knocking him out. Let's just try the non-violent way first. So, I want to know right, how, how she becomes to get this guy to like us if he punished to talk Laura. To us. I don't know. Like with the eye patch and everything. And he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Hey, hey, T money. T money. T money. Why? <laughs> Why? You Good question. Call me Officer Hackett. Hackett. Like as in Hackett's quarry? We already been through this. What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way. <laughs> oh, come on, Team Money, lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. <laughs> Specifically seven. Let me check my path real quick. Where am I? It's not that one. Oh. That was it. That's it. Okay. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. Oh. <laughs> I see what you're doing. The <laughs> sheriff isn't That's buying. Not gonna work. You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here? Not gonna happen. Asshole. Max. That went well. We know what's going on. I chose that specifically because of like, we were honest before. Mm -hmm. But I guess. If we know Max dice. is a werewolf. Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Oh, you, you ma'am da. Yeah, <laughs> ma'am. She's too young to be a man. I said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck oh, off. Excuse Get me. Back. That's what's going on. Hi. Get the fuck away from him. Why's he got to take his clothes off to be a werewolf? He doesn't have to, but I don't want to have to get new clothes. Come here. <laughs> um. 
you. Get off of me! Shut up. Max does it. Have a seat. Quit, oh. Squirman. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not going to believe it until you see it for yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get Does this mean we get to see it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna leave it. Down to 20. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you. It's not gonna be pretty. She's gonna try and help him and then worry. he's gonna twat her in the ass. <laughs> yeah. Dawn. You're really gonna leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. Don't burn your arm on the radiator. Again. It's a bit sweaty. You're doing alright there, bud. It's not looking good. Yo, video game stream or watch party? Let's go. <laughs> Don't worry, Max. I'm here. Yeah. Yeah, right. Are you all right? Uh, yeah. I don't know. I just don't feel so good. Mr. Stark. Look at his <laughs> veins. What do you need? What can I do to help? Oh, it's just hot. Are you hot? <laughs> Oh, I'm kind of stuck next to this big ass pipe, so I'm not exactly cool. Just stay back, okay? You shouldn't be this close. There's not a lot I can do about that right now. Max? It doesn't look fun, does it? Max? What's going on? Oh, yeah. What's happening? He's about to. His teeth are already there, I think. His hands. Yeah. His hands are puffing up. I'm pretty sure you can't stop it by shouting his name, Laura. He's going to, to explode into a werewolf. Yep. Oh, that's yeah. why there was blood everywhere. Yeah. Ah, oh. Cool. We said they'll get too close in there. Yeah. Well, she. That's all right. How, how did she get out? How did she get out? What happened to the handcuffs? And how come she is not infected? Fuck! Because she got scratched, not bit. That's a very good point. Same with um, uh, Abigail, why she's not infected, she got scratched. Not yeah, very good point. Oh, it's okay. close to got the pipe, okay. I like the music. Perception. Like, so much depth for depth perception. Like Laura is born. <laughs> <laughs> she's damaged Laura. So now. yeah, she got punished, Laura. <laughs> That's what it is. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. We just in, gonna which, ignore Max. Which incidentally now. is the name of the ep episode for episode eight of this playthrough when it comes out, whenever. Punished Laura. She just looks like Punished Snake from Metal Gear Solid. I know you won't get the reference at all, but for everyone who does, yeah. <laughs> um, um, What's Max up to? Max, you're. Oh, there he is. <laughs> yeah, are you doing okay, buddy? I think he's a bit peckish. He needs a salmon spread. He's in the sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, don't burn yourself on the thingy. I love it. The, I love the. I understood that reference. Big old. Uh, I didn't. Um. While the town of North lay sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping, and as the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues creeping. Now, now we've seen this. She said this in the scene mm -hmm. before. Continue looking. <laughs> I'm gonna take a nap yeah. right here. <laughs> right now. Right here. Right now. Right here. Right now. Yes. Riveting. Well, that's that loose brick. Yeah. From before. Mm -hmm. Most thing we can do about that. Where's the, where's the, where's Sheriff Hackett? He's gone off to do some stuff. Sheriff thing. He's playing sheriff. I'm looking. I'm honestly looking for a tarot card at this point. Also, why does the camera have to be so close? There's something behind that. What even is it? I can explore most of the thingy. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. Same with Hackett. Yeah, oh, Chris Hackett. But I can't leave. Until dawn. <laughs> I was going to say, I was going to say, I thought Nicely that was the... Nicely done. What's he hiding? A fucking lot, obviously. There's a whole ass upstairs we can uh, look at too. Uh, oh, there's a whole lot I can explore actually. Imagine go to bed. <laughs> but I'm scared of like triggering something that will progress the game too. Like I think, I think the sheriff left in the building entirely. I'm not to be. I'm not meant to be walking around. Hello. Now, hearing voices, we've heard voices on the phone before, hmm. and I remember when Ryan was going to call the cops, and then the line cut. The line got cut immediately. So there's something in the phone lines, or something going on with the phone lines. She's really just adjusted hint, well. My birthday. How much a hint is a slap in the face. To having one eye. She's what? She's adjusting well. It's not that bad. It's not, it's not that bad. Yeah, you've lost an eye? No, I've not lost an eye, but. I've... You've had your eye ripped out by your boyfriend who's a werewolf now? I've had an eye not work. <laughs> don't for, think for it's the, the same. For the majority of the <laughs> don't day. Don't think it's the I've same. I've had to deal with like the, <laughs> the depth perception being fucked for the majority of the day. Anne Radcliffe and Edward Benson. Wonder who they are. The two who preceded you two. Mm -hmm. They roam in the woods. All right, so the hint is my birthday. We can't get into that computer without finding, finding out. out when his birthday is. When is his birthday? Is there anything? Any clues? Sasha and Digweed. Okay. Is that... <clears throat> Fuck. I'm gonna need to rest soon. Uh, you're gonna run out of exploration I, If that time. is a... If that is a timer... 
fuck off. What are you hiding, Travis? His name is Travis. Cease and desist letter. Mm. A letter instructing those behind the bizarre yet bona fide podcast to stop investigating Hacker's Quarry. Do I get to read? Do I get to read the contents? No. No. Yes, I just have to look at it again. It's weird. Tragic, Travis Hackett. It has come to my attention uh, that you recently released an episode of your podcast that features the town of North Kill, and uh, more specifically Hackett's Quarry. If I'm to understand the context correctly, said episode investigates the mystery of a ghost in the woods. Though the very idea of this is completely preposterous, as and as I'm sure you're aware, no such thing thing exists. I am writing to tell you that the proprietors of Hackett's Quarry, Quarry have expressed concerns that such unsavory stories could be detrimental to, the, to their various business avenues, including Hackett's, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, which prides itself on being a safe envi environment, safe fun environment for children from oh next page, yeah from all over the country. It, it is with this in mind that I ask you to take down this episode of your podcast and refrain from releasing any further unsolicited publicity around Hackers Quarry. The proprietors of said land would not be against seeking legal action if you do not comply with their requests. Please accept this letter as a formal request with the both, with, with the both benefit of parties. What? The, with the benefit, benefit of both, both parties, parties in mind. My, my, my eyes are skipping around. Uh, respectfully yours, Travis Hackett, Sheriff North Kill Police Department. NKPD. All right. No birthday or anything or any sort there. This is not. There's a whole house upstairs as well, and a door here. Locked. Locked. Figures. And I guess I can't leave Max. Better keep snooping, or I could go back to my cell and wait. I guess. I need to lie down. Do you want to hustle, lady? She needs to lie down. You might fuck her over by making her explore for too long. Maybe, but I hope not. All right, what's in here? What's that? Something. Happy birthday, son. Mama's boy. Fifty-six, huh? Where does the time go? 56. 1965. There that you go. means he was born in 1965. This means this takes place in 2021, 2022, give or take, depending on the month. Um, what did you say, 1965? Cool. This room is the birthday room because uh, there's fuck all else. Actually, you never know because when you walk into in certain places, then the camera angle changes and you like get to see a card, but no such thing exists. Yeah. Nope. Syringes. This must be what he used to knock me out. Oh, yeah. Well, keep one on hand. You never know when it might come in handy. Myself. Wow. Can you imagine not snooping around? <laughs> Wait, is that the door I came through? Yes, it is. In which case, it's very dark in here. Full moon, July 24th. Oh, so it's 2021 then, yeah. Birthday right. beers. July 7th. July 7th. Back to the computer we go. <laughs> yeah. Everything we needed was down upstairs. Holding L1 or LB to hustle, to saunter. I've got the Lion King in my head. What song? 
He lives in you. <laughs> he lives in me. <laughs> Everything we see. Is that Lion King too? Yeah. Yeah, I never watched but that. But it is in Lion King the musical. Oh, is it? Yeah, they work it in there. Oh, okay. And there was an advert and myself on TV I on my break sleep. for Lion King the musical. Not really. We just we just and basically yeah. found the password to the computer just now. Uh, we found stuff that relating to his birthday. Email. You heard this shit. You got to shut it down. Can you handle it? Be the podcast for me. Yeah, the podcast. Yeah, Chris. That was Chris. If you sent that. Mm -hmm. This is the podcast now. Weren't hikers at all, but ghost hunters who went in search of answers and. An episode of the Supernatural Investigation Podcast, Bizarre Yet Bonafide, exploring the mysteries around the Hag of Haggard's Quarry. This might be the podcast that Ryan's been listening to. Mm. Um, and that voice sounds very familiar. Fell victim to the mercy of the Hag of Haggard's Quarry, never to be seen again. Like us. Except for the fell victim to the mercy of the blah, 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 blah part. We're, we're more like um, ghost investigators. Spectre sleuths? Sure. So, what happened next? Well, according to reports from the local paper, the North Kill Gazette, some hay bales caught fire during the opening night, and that spread pretty quickly. Before this they is the fire. It, the place mm -hmm. was up in the smoke, including the Did it crash? No, it's gone weird. The audio scrambled. What is the threat? <laughs> Bizarre yet bona fide. You listen to the podcast. Hold well on. All right, time to sleep. What is the threat? Because now it's like. I told you. It's digital. You told me what? There was like multiple threats? Yeah. But some of them will be decoys. Hmm. Red herrings. This monarch is too good. Jesus. It's gone. Sorry. Um, where do you go? Was this the door? I'm trying to go back to the cell. Mm -hmm. But I don't remember where I came from. I mean, she has just lost an eye. She's probably in some form of shock. <laughs> Let's go check on Max. Mm, I don't know. Hey, buddy, you okay? Good. Just give me two snarls when you need me, okay? I'll be right here. I want my cider. We'll get it then. I want it. What's up? You tell me what happened. I could ask you the same thing. Yeah. Why didn't you run? I won't leave Max. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. You didn't hide Seriously? that syringe. I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me too. What was that? You see that? It's not something. I don't it's know. Cool. We didn't hide the syringe. No. God, fuck. I did think about that. Yeah, well. same. 
Ah. You need to go that way. <laughs> the brick wall. Yeah. I figured she would just hide it like no. automatically. I saw you doing it and I was like. Why aren't you saying anything? Because <laughs> I thought you knew what you were doing. You should have said something. Especially when I sat down. There was a whole confirmation process too. <laughs> Should have said something. You had time. <laughs> you should have used your noggin. Whoa. Oh. Empty head, just vibes. Ah, <laughs> oh, fucked it. That's what you used to knock me out with, isn't it? This is dangerous. Could you not have used that on Max last night? Maybe I'd still have two good eyes. Yes. Yes, but it's really fucking hard to do. Ah. You got me good, game. You got me good. <laughs> I got got. What's this? And that He's got new clothes. Watch. He's going to show him him. Nice job cleaning up the eye. I mean. It's harder than they make out in the textbooks. I know, like his whole self explodes, but you. then he's just fine again. Um, they generally were werewolves do uh, go back animal. to normal. Yeah, Doctor no, but the way animal. he turns into a werewolf is very I mean, like yeah, violent. Yeah, like his whole body explodes, Blood, yes. but then he's just fine. You know, just because you know doesn't mean you know. <laughs> you know. Oh, uh, I know. That you know, but they don't know. That you know, that I know. You and we sick. know. <laughs> this isn't what it seems to be. You're gonna have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family. We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying mm -hmm. to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. Hmm. We're going to end this thing once and for all. We? Yeah. I've got so questions. How is your family I've got questions. Involved? My family is down at the bottom of a well. What? What? Family is the most important thing in the world. Yeah, it depends who you ask. Your whole family, you know, like. Every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well, and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope. How can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. If you pull on that rope, and you're just going to fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. And what's the point of that? Right, so you... You're the one at the top <laughs> of the well. So how I'm understanding this is... Uh, mm -hmm. Yes. I thought that was obvious. <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, I got it. Let's forget it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> honestly, weird metaphor. Let's see how smart you really are. Just that. What is this? 
information. Can I see? Well, what does it mean? Read it. Can I read? When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. It sure does burst one outward. One leads that cider is potent. It stalks yeah. your breath, but shuns your water. And should Wait, you what? yourself be cursed, armed with silver, and the first. When moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight, or fear the dread of full moon's light. So it can be reversed. It's a curse. Keep reading. And if it's a bite with which it's you're your faced, face. cleave Seems limb from torso, torso with great. great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. They hate water too. I mentioned. Which and is what happened with Nick. Frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? <laughs> um, all right. Newspaper headlines crapped. The freak show goes up in flames. We have learned something. The fire of Harum's scarum six years ago took the lives of many, and it's rumored to have been arson. No wonder it made the front page. That's it, really. Above the law. Laura didn't try to take Travis's gun. I don't know. But it's all we have to go on. They've got to defeat the OG one, yeah. Kill the werewolf that, that bit you, you and, and you'll, you'll be cured, be yeah. It has to be silver, it has to be full moon. Seems pretty it, straightforward to it's me. It's a progression thing. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big F. I just want to cure Max. Then you have to kill the werewolf the bit him. It's not as straightforward as you think. No, I guess not. <laughs> Never is. No. Well, we can ask that and confirm. Hmm. So wait, if Max got me in the eye, does not that mean I'm infected now too? No. Okay. Scratches don't do it. Only bites. Are you sure about that? Pretty sure. So what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. Me? Yeah. Because your studies. Because <laughs> she's been training to the event. Started. Well, you're the best option I got. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Look, take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Hmm. Seen enough? I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't seen it for yourself. If I hadn't seen that. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. Fair point. The fair point. Well, 
fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're gonna fix it on our own. Hey, Laura? Yeah? I saw what happened. I'm sorry. What I did to your eye? Yeah. Is it bad? It's fucking gone, mate. <laughs> it's gone. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. They both say the same thing to me. Mm. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. But it was. We're gonna fix you, Max. I promise. I promise. The question is, where is Max now? You said let me in there. Chris. Oh, Chris. I know they're in there. Who? The townsperson didn't show up. How'd you find out? Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Shit. <laughs> Why? Why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here? That's fucked up. Fucking bit one of them, Chris. What's I supposed to do? Uh, ah, that makes... I was thinking about this <laughs> when he, like, sped off. Oof. I was thinking, like, <laughs> maybe it's because he's one of them. You shot me. I'm telling Mom. You <laughs> I'm telling Mom! <laughs> What's your plan? Can't keep him here forever. I'm handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? Oh. If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Are those know. hikers? And that, that, that fucking journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we going to do now? Whatever happened to... We're all We're in this all together. In this <laughs> together <laughs> once we know. Go to my office. We shouldn't talk here. I'm wondering if failing that QTE Max. was optional. Uh, Max. Uh, what is it? We Travis wouldn't. was just in the hall talking. The cop. We wouldn't be able to hear the rest of that conversation mm. if we'd let that thing drop. And like, I was so not prepared for it too. So, with Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Holy shit, that's... Who would have guessed? I mean, I guess, thinking about it, I could have... And yet you didn't. <laughs> all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. If, if, Which is if why Chris, Chris bailed. The one that bit me, then he has to die to save you. Yeah, then that's our cure. Which is why she's looking for Chris that's Hackett in the present. You. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Tomorrow but surely Max has here. to kill him. I don't know if it specifies. The cursed must kill the cursor. Mm. I'm gonna get Travis's gun and kill Chris Hackett. She smiled about that. Hey! Hey! Help her! Laura needs help! This arc is going for a while. Uh, Laura! Just pretend I've got Laura, you okay? some DMV. God damn it. What's going on, Laura? What's she gonna do? Pretend she's got an infection in the eye. <laughs> He's like, fuck's <laughs> sake. 
Oh. Focus. I thought I thought it was a shot. Give me the Light keys. You. you don't have to do this. Give me the keys. I'm sorry, but I do. Let's just talk about it. You had your chance to talk. Keys. Okay. Okay. Fuck. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, careful. Mm. I had to catch it because if I fumbled it, he was looking for a fumble. <laughs> Path chosen. Mm. This is a whole new path then. Not path updated, path Above chosen. Left Laura left Travis locked in her cell. He didn't look like that when we left him, but sure. Mm -hmm. uh, and then there's another one called the White Whale. Uh consumed by obsession. When the chance to grasp all you ever wanted remain I uh, mean sacrificing all you ever had. Do you take it? Laris did not. Laris? Laura did not shoot Travis when escaping her cell. Did we have the option to? I never knew you had it in you. <laughs> yeah, you did. Come on. Laura, please think about what you're doing. <laughs> you went, boy, you don't. Why don't you take some time? Think about why you're in here. <laughs> Using his words against him. Mm. I like that. Sorry. Hmm. <laughs> he really prepped the back backhand. <laughs> we should grab our staff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. What is it? I thought I heard someone. Someone thinks he... no, I, I still can. It's coming from behind that door. Oh, he's hearing it too. Nobody in here. What the fuck? He makes them. Oh. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last so That's what she used to kill the werewolf in the present time. <coughs> the one that was in the pool. Well, I guess I won't be needing this anymore. Hey. I just realized something. We're free. <laughs> Hell yeah, we are. That's two months we'll never get back, but for now, we're one step closer to going home. And when is that? Tonight. We're going to Hackett's quarry, and we're killing Chris Hackett. Chris Hackett's the final boss, <laughs> it seems. Mm -hmm. 
So the question is, where is Chris Hackett? Mm.